tonight, Maryland wildlife managers are accused in a lawsuit of keeping some data secret. This has to do with the biomedical industry and the high value of some blood taken from the wild species called the horseshoe crab. Environmental activists fear those crabs may be on the road to extinction. In tonight's Environment Matters report, Scott Broom unwinds this fascinating story and what it all says about our coastal environment under stress. This right here is a horseshoe crab. They swarm the beaches in Maryland and Delaware this time of year to lay eggs. Fishermen used to wastefully kill millions of them to use as bait, and then something fascinating happened. Scientists discovered horseshoe crab blood, which is blue, by the way, can detect contamination in medicines, vaccines, and medical devices like nothing else. That blue blood is now worth as much as $15,000 a quart and biomedical companies hire fishermen to help them harvest it with the aim of releasing the horseshoe crabs live, but some of them don't make it. So now we get to this new lawsuit. Environmentalists are really worried about a decline in horseshoe crabs. They fear climate change and overharvesting is having a domino effect, causing all sorts of rare birds and marine life that depend on crab eggs to go down too. Conservation groups are trying to collect data to make their case that horseshoe crabs need to be protected under the Endangered Species Act. But Maryland's Department of Natural Resources has refused to release data on how many of the crabs are taken by the biomedical industry and how many survive. A group called the Center for Biological Diversity has sued Maryland to get the numbers. American University law professor Bill Snape helped file the suit. By every scientific indication, this species is tanking, in part because they're losing their beaches to climate change, but the fact that the pharmaceutical industry literally takes hundreds of thousands of these animals and bleeds them every year clearly is impacting the species on some level, and we want to figure out exactly to what extent. Now, Maryland's Department of Natural Resources is declining to comment because of litigation. Horseshoe crabs, meanwhile, are starting their spawn on the region's beaches right now. Living fossils that have been on Earth since way before the dinosaurs, but which now have blood worth its weight in gold and which without protections may have met their match after all this time on Earth from us. For Environment Matters, Scott Broom, WUSA 9.